I'm thrilled to be here with the amazing Kelly Jansen. Kelly, could you just introduce yourself, please? Yeah, of course. Hi, everyone. My name is Kelly Jansen, and I am uh, the Creation Station um, owner for Sutton and Ashfield and Hucknell in Nottinghamshire. Thank you very much. Um, what inspired you to start running your own creative business, Kelly? Um, I kind of, I knew about Creation Station um, for many years because actually um, I used to take my eldest daughter to little explorer sessions um, and at the time I was a primary school teacher um, so it was such an amazing experience as a parent to take Fiona along to the sessions um, and she absolutely loved them and even to this day she's absolutely mad on art and craft and I think it's from having that really early experience. Um, so it was always something that I'd been interested in. And when I used to take her, it was very much like, oh, you know, I'd love to do this. How lucky are these people that this is their job kind of thing. Um, but life's life. And I just kind of carried on um, with my teaching career, which at the time I was really enjoying. Um, absolutely passionate about working with children, loved being with the children in school. Um, but as the years went on, I kind of fell out of love, I suppose, with the profession. Um, I mean, there was a lot of workload um, that I didn't necessarily feel was beneficial to the children that I was I was teaching. Um, it took me away from my own family a lot of the time because I had to work at the weekends. I missed all the school drop offs and pickups. Um, and just got to that point where I really was starting to look for a change in career. And it was my husband, actually, that said to me, you know, oh, do you remember, you know, the Creation Station? You always said you wanted to, to kind of own a franchise like that. And that's where it started from, really. Um, I left my teaching and, uh, yeah, started on the journey. So I went to a discovery morning, um, really just to find out some information and just kind of um, just to see if it was something that was possible. Um, and it all kind of just spiralled from there, really. And I never looked back. So it's been amazing. And we've seen fantastic reviews of what you've done. Also, you've inspired people even through lockdown with loads of different activities. And we've just been chatting beforehand that your classes are, are booking. You've got, you've added on extra classes. You've even got waiting lists and you're going to be going into schools. Can you tell me a little bit about that as well? Yeah, yeah. So I run um, a weekly uh, baby discover and little explorer session. So I do a mixed session. So I have uh, babies from six months up to preschoolers up until about the age of five. So just before they go to school. Um, and I launched those in October. Um, and really that came about, I wasn't planning on doing those sessions um, from a primary school teaching background. I kind of, I was thinking that my business would be focused more on the older children. Um, but then with uh, the pandemic, with lockdown, um, you could really see that, you know, parents of young, young children and babies were really struggling and they needed some of that support. They want, they still wanted to go to the classes. They wanted to have that social side. They wanted to see their babies develop and have those experiences. So I thought I'd just kind of give it a go and, and see how I got on. So I launched them in October um, and it's been absolutely brilliant. And I, I love them. I love it. I love the energy. So, yeah, and it's just kind of built from there. And um, I'm really lucky to be um, part of a Facebook group um, for young mums and parents in the local community. Um, so I can have a good chat with, you know, with parents on that both as myself and as a business owner. Um, and a lot of my customers have come from there and I'm getting to the point now where I get lots of recommendations and yeah, I've just launched uh, bookings for next term. Um, and I think with going back to face to face, everyone's like, yes, I just want to get out of the house and go and do some lovely creative experiences with my child. So it's been amazing. Yeah. And I'm hoping, you know, with, with things kind of easing, restrictions lifting, that kind of running after school clubs, can really kind of get back on the uh, agenda because that will be absolutely amazing with my you know with my previous teaching experience I really do miss being in in school and being with the children in, in that environment so that would be fantastic too. Well I think everyone in the Nottingham area would be mad not to be at to your classes uh, I've seen the reviews I know what you like Kelly you put your heart and soul into everything that you do you've been a fantastic support to to Creative Station and you know, head office team for the last year and uh, we wouldn't be the same without you. So thank you so much for thank all you. that you do to inspire imagination. Thank you very much. Take care.
Baker, and here's to more inspiration in the Nottingham area. Take Yay. care. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye bye. Not in veggie, not not in game. Um, so whenever you're ready. Hi everybody, my name is Kelly Jansen and I am the Creation Station Leader for um, City of Ashfield and Pucknell area of Nottinghamshire. Um, I was really attracted to the uh, creative journey of beginning um, my own Creation Station franchise. Um, basically, as from being a mum um, and having those shared experiences with my um, eldest daughter when I used to take her to Little Explorers sessions. Um, and just really having that wonderful time together, being creative and doing something that we both loved. Um, I'm also a Usborne um, independent organiser and it was kind of the same thing. It, it's, it's that idea of sharing um, those lovely experiences and creating those memories with your children, you know, and as an Usborne um, independent organiser, get loads of free books so we can sit down and really share with our children. The Creation Station is very much the same. Um, you know, my children help me um, organise and prep for the classes. They sit and do a lot of the crafts with me um, before I take them to my classes. Um, so it really is a family business, I suppose, in lots of ways. Um, and I've really settled into it now. Um, bookings are coming along really nicely. I've been doing it for a year now. Um, and finally got that really strong customer base. Um, I feel like I'm known within the area. Um, and people really want to come and, and have those experiences with their children and come along to classes. So it's been absolutely amazing. Um, and it just offers so much flexibility and time. And I just love the fact that I can do it with my family around me. It's been brilliant. Perfect. I know them. That's one thing that is nice about doing it online is that you really get that kind of sense of being able to to have that one-to-one -one, um, interaction a lot more, even though it's through a screen. Um, I'm getting some really good eye contact from some of the babies. Um, and yeah, I just feel like I've get to know the mums. We have a, a good old chat about everything as well. It, it's great fun, really great fun. So I'm looking forward to it. Enjoy it and less clearing up. <laughs> less clearing up. I know I do apologize every single week to my parents because I'm like, I'm going now, bye-bye, and then they have to go and tidy up. And that is definitely the positive of coming to a face-to-face -face class that you 